Hey guys, I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We're saving the world one trailer at a time. Today we're gonna look at the 2020 Jayco Talon 335T. Cameraman? T. This model comes in right underneath 12,000 pounds. It's got two slides on it, a garage in the back, whole lot of features. It's from the second half of 2020 when Jayco made all their changes, positive changes. This thing looks hot inside. Uh, beautiful outside. It's basically like an eagle toy hauler called the Jayco Talon. Let's uh, let's get into it. We're up front here, we got a wicked looking front molded power cap, power cap, front molded cap. It's got LED lights built in right here. It's gonna light up your front hitch for you. This part of the cap is painted, so that's not gonna fade over time. Uh, underneath here, we have our gas generator. That's 5,500 watts. It runs on a tank from the back. And then in front here is where your batteries are gonna go. Lazy Acres provides one battery. There's obviously space there to put a secondary battery if you want. This is our wardrobe slide right here, pulling our wardrobe off the floor of the trailer. We have propane tanks here on either side. There's one 30 here, and then another 30 on the other side. Right here is our pass-through storage. Goes all the way through. It's lit up nicely with these lights here. That's a motion sensitive lights. When you open the door, light's gonna come on. We got a uh, uh, battery disconnect right here, and this one has the auto level option put on. Like always guys, when you're watching our new videos, the options and the colors can change. One of those options is auto leveling. Uh, right here we have our convenience center. Nice and enclosed. It's, this is a, like a, a metal here, so that's not going to wear down over time. We got our gate valves down below. We have our water hookups for winterizing, sanitizing, winterizing, uh, city water connection, fresh water fill, black water flush, all that right in through here. You have your cable inlets, battery disc, sorry, not battery disc, uh, water heater bypass, and an outside shower with our solar prep right through there. Furnace vent, 50 amp service on this model. Here's our main slide, pulling our couch off the floor of the trailer. We got huge tires on these, R16s, eight bolt rims, Goodyear tires, Goodyear endurance tires, nitro fill, uh, aluminum rims of course. It's also got the Moorride 3000 built into it. That actually travels three inches up and down. Gives you, um, uh, really helps you eliminate chucking. If you want to make this thing even better, you can swap out that pin box in the front for a Moorride pin box, and that really works well in conjunction. We got six point auto leveling. It's electric on this model. We have our fuel tank right here, which is gonna fuel our generator or it's gonna fuel our, ah, uh, hang on, I do have the key on me. Or it's gonna fuel our fuel station, which is what we see right here. Coming down this side, you can see we have our side mount uh, ladder, it obviously can't be on the back because we have the deck on the back or the patio on the back or the ramp on the back, whatever you want to say. We have our patio here all fenced off nicely. This one's got stairs to go off the back of them. That's pretty handy. And then it's basically got like a built-in door right here. So when you come up the stairs, you just roll this right across, bingo bango. We've got a, uh, an awning off the back here that's manual. We got a uh, back of camera prep and then two LED lights out on our deck right here. Really bright today guys, sorry if we're kind of in the shadows or off and on here, but try to do this on these nice days. Uh, down the side here, you have a spot to crank up and down your spare tire. We have a vent for the garage, Ent four entry step here, uh, more ride step above on the main area, on the main step. Fridge vents, 10 gallon gas electric water heater, Big leather hand grab handle, handle on the stairs too, outside speakers down below, outside spray port that's just for cold water right here, and then the other side of our pass-through storage. Right on. Forgot to talk about the awning, good size electric awning, it has LED lights up built into it as well. That was the outside guys, let's look inside. Hey guys, we're inside that 2020 Talon 335T. Right now you're standing right in the corner of the bedroom, looking across our bed here. It's a queen size bed, 60 inches wide, 80 inches long. Good amount of storage here around the top and around the side of that bed. We got those doors popped open for you. Uh, bedside tables, there's nice little blue night lights right here and then reading lights above. On this built into the table here, we have a drawer and a cubby. 
which you can see there on your side. There's a big door side window that we have closed off right now for the blind, but that's a nice feature there. And to your left, we have our bedroom uh, TV already mounted there. That's an option, you know, it's on this one. We have a um, uh, window here behind, light, behind a blind, of course, light, two drawers here as well. Then we're into our wardrobe here. Lots of hanging. Big drawer down below. Okay. Then we're down the down the hallway here. Notice there's very very little carpets, only where it is finished off around the sides there. Have a look at this uh, washroom here. Right on. Seamless countertop, undermount sink, stainless steel nickel brush. Kind of that's not stainless steel, it's plastic, but it's like a nickel brush finish to it. Um, medicine cabinet with LED lights around it. Two storage doors down below, porcelain toilet, big garden tub style shower, lots of elbow room, lots of shoulder space, spot I can sit down and shave my legs. Um, pantry, or not pantry, a linen closet, pardon me, spot there you can hang your towels. Let's head down to the living space here. We have our theater seats. These are heat and massage on the two outside ones, all three reclined. There is um, windows all the way around, nice sconce lighting right there. All LED guys, of course, it's 2020. We have storage here above. Radio right there, a little bit of a pocket, a uh, little cubby down the side there. Um, nice little hutch kind of area there. Receptacle, light, storage down below. Okay. Really big door here separating the garage from the living space. It's not gonna feel like you're you know, walking uh, sideways down something. That's a nice touch. Um, storage here above the fridge, really deep. That goes about two feet back there. We have an eight cubic foot gas electric fridge. Okay. Big pot and pan drawer right down there. Some more drawers here. Got the Furion range. Light up the oven there, blue lights on the stove top. Covered right through here. Three cupboard drawers. Four remotes. Goodness gracious. I have a hard time with two. Solid surface countertop. You're going to have a cutting board and a drying rack right here. Uh, that is nice and solid. Pull down faucet. Look at the size of this cupboard right there. And then we have two more here above the microwave. And then a Really cool looking microwave right through there. Then here's your main door, you're walking in. You have a spot to hang your jackets, okay? You could flip this down and have shelves here, but that's a good spot for jackets if you ask me. Right above me is where our TV is, facing the theater seats. I love it when things like that make sense. And then there's another spot here to hang jackets as well. Awesome, let's turn around, get into our garage. I do want to point out this door opens up and it just Magnets over there to the side. Really nice attention to detail by Jayco. Right now, we have it set up so that you have the rollover style sofas ready to sit on and eat at. Then we have a bunk here above. We're gonna come back here later on the video, show you what this garage looks like with it closed up. But we have windows on both sides. That one's just covered right now with the blind. Uh, then up there, we have spots to hang things. Cupboards here above. A prep. For a, for a, a backup camera in here so you could have a separate screen in your truck with a camera here watching your toys as you go down the road. Really nice feature. More hanging spots right here. Another window here on the door side and a closet or a cupboard right there with our third TV, right? Yeah, three, one bedroom living and uh, in the garage here. Awesome guys, we'll come back and look at this put away. Hey guys, we're still back in that garage. You're basically standing in the doorway looking towards the back. Uh, this is with the beds up all the way. If you need a little more height than this, like I'm six foot, so you got about six and a half feet there. Uh, but if you need a little more height, you can always rotate these down to the side and then drive your big side by side in here or something like that. But you probably have enough height overall. Uh, awesome. That was the 2020 Jayco Talon 335T. If you like that video, hit like. If you want to subscribe, 
please do so. Our email is sales at lazyacres.com or our phone number is 705-833-2539. Thanks, guys. Have a good day.